Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Tim from Unborn Entertainment. Uh, a lot of people have been asking me how do I have my equipment hooked up uh, to Logic. So today I'm going to show you to, or tonight rather, I'm going to show you how to hook up uh, your Motif. I have a Motif ES6 and I have it running as a MIDI inside of uh, Logic. So the first thing you need to do, unfortunately, I don't have a camera to go over to that Motif uh, unit, but uh, the first thing you need to do is uh, press the utility button on your motif and then when you do make sure you're on the MIDI tab and I have my motif hooked up uh, to my uh, system using MIDI not USB so make sure that that MIDI in out is set to MIDI and then there's a sync tab right next to the other tab click on that sync tab and make sure it says internal because you want it to trigger the internal sounds of the motif alright so that's good to go um, the only thing that I have to do now is make sure that I am on an empty track. For me, that would be track 33. So that's an empty track. And then I hit patch, and all 16 of my patches are there. So now let's get inside of Logic and get Logic to see the, uh, the 16 channels of the motif. All right, I'm going to create a new empty project. and I'm going to set it to external MIDI and only want one channel so I can show you how to do this it's really simple as you can see uh, Logic has set up this and it's gone to the general MIDI device I have my motif hooked into port 1 of my MIDI I.O. Um, so all I do is uh, go to the mixer screen here the MIDI track is already set up and I need to get an auxiliary channel so then go to options create a new auxiliary channel strip uh, let's do stereo I have mine set to stereo I have a left and right going in my motif is hooked up to my input 3 and 4 this is very important because sometimes you click here and not you you if you forget to click uh, assign this to the correct channel uh, you won't hear anything so mine is set to 3 4 let's get it to 3 4 here input 3 4 Okay, go ahead and create it. And it created the stereo out and the master out. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of that. I don't need that for right now. And uh, if I hit the keys on my motif, um, you don't hear anything. And the reason why is because the um, auxiliary track here is set to um, uh, infinite, infinity, zero, minus negative infinity. So let's bring that up. I, I usually hit the uh, the option, then click on the Mac and bring that up to zero. Now I can hear the piano that's on tra on uh, MIDI channel one over there. Now this is highlighted, so let's go over here and look. We need to make sure it's set to MIDI I/O port one because that's where I have my motif, and there are the 16 channels that's going to match up with the motif. Uh, let me click over here and see what's going on. Okay, that's set to MIDI port one. I have uh, 16 tracks over there, so I have the piano on number one, so I'm going to go ahead and tell it to, to uh, read channel one. Um, just for, because I think I have less than 10 minutes on YouTube, I'm going to create another one right quick, another MIDI track. Uh, let's go here, external MIDI, create. All right, there's my second one. Um, if I highlight the second one, you'll see that Logic already figured it out. It says, oh, this is this must be for channel two. So I'm going to throw some drums on there, and I'm going to leave a piano on this first one. So let's go to the first one right quick. And let's uh, do four bars of piano. I'm just going to play something real quick. Uh, just hit some keys so you can see how this works. plays back let's go to the next track and you see it changed over here to number two and let's change this I'm going to go over here to track two on my motif and I am going to put some drums on the next track and okay and let's see what happens here let's record enable this track and just That's, 
and that's pretty much it. That's how you get your your stuff into Logic, and you can lay up to 16 tracks like that. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it, and it is time now for me to actually go in here and start making some beats. All right, talk to you later.